We should just put two pieces of salami right up there for SRK's nipples. You think so? Yeah, why not? <laughs> and then right underneath it, big beast tasty nuts. Why don't Why don't I just print out pictures of SRK? There's ample pictures of his nipples. That's true. Do you think there's another actor who's had their nipples exposed more often on film? Kim Kardashian. That's true. <laughs> Hey, welcome back to our stupid reaction with Tim Corbin. Kim Kardashian, greatest actor of all time. Right, folks? It's true. And you can follow us on Instagram, Instagram Twitter, 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 he did a, because he lives in Dubai a lot of times. He yeah, a, he did a, a uh, come to Dubai thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This, this is another one, that, but it just released, like, just yesterday. I'm going to guess, not just because I see the uh, the beginning of the thing there, I have a feeling he's going to spread his arms wide open. He's going to spread his legs. Wow, and thumbs up will come out. <laughs> uh, what should be our next Shah Rukh Khan film? That's not highly contested. Let's not at know. all. Here we go. That's cute. Dubai presents Shah Rukh Khan in Dubai. There he is, arm spread. And cut. Great job, Shah Rukh. Was it good? Man, thank you, Ash. Oh. All right, guys, pack it up. Hi, baby. Yeah, you home? No, no, no. I'm, I'm not at home. I'm at the shoot. Oh. Yeah, and I have a long day. How boring, Dad. You're in Dubai. Right. Walk around. Have fun. That sounds like a good idea. Talk later. Love you. Love you too. There we go. Shah Rukh Khan said this one. Shah Rukh Khan said this one. Vegas on points. Yeah, pretty much. This is a long ad. No, darling. I'm back home now. How was your day? Did you have some fun? Thanks to you. I had the best day of my life. It's hard to have a better spokesperson. If I go to Dubai and I, and I don't see SRK dancing with me, I'm suing for false advertising. <laughs> it's true. I would like to dance with SRK. That was a long ad. Well, 
depends on how much you're paying Shah Rukh Khan. You need to get your money. That's money's true. Get worth. your money's worth. <laughs> <laughs> and we know we've done a lot of ad stuff before. A lot of the advertising things we've seen are cute. almost like short films sometimes, yeah. and that was, that that, was that, if the job for that was to highlight the beauty and the excitement and fun of Dubai, they did a great job, and they have a pretty good spokesperson. I don't know what other cities have a better spokesperson. I mean, we, I guess we've seen some that have Big B uh, a while back that he was the spokesperson for, but it's hard to have a better spokesperson. True. Well, it's interesting because he is a fantastic spokesperson, but in America... People would be, a lot of them would like go, why is he the spokesperson? It's like, well, because he's an international phenomenon and you live in a cave. <laughs> Trust me, I know. I lived there once. It's so, a nice cave. It's a nice cave. It's I've a little, da- a little, a little damp. damp. A little dark. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, I yeah, love, you pretty much can't get a better spokesperson. I love his hair. I could tell. I love his hair. I could tell. Like, especially... In where is it? Right I here. know you like on the that beach. one on the beach. Oh the pirate yeah! Thing. Look at that. Yeah. And obviously that's for uh, Puffin. Is that what the film was called? The new action one. Yes. His yeah. his his new one the, that's coming out also twenty twenty nine. Did you guys know that twenty twenty two is the year of our Lord and Savior Topeka Patacom? What? She has like five films coming oh. out this year. <laughs> <laughs> she has that one, the the one we saw. But then she's got, oh, I know this one's coming out next January, but then she's got one with Rithik coming out. Hey, Fafa, get working. Slacking. Come on. Film a month. No excuses. One a month. Um, it seems like, uh, maybe it's, maybe I'm just reading into it, it seems like Shah Rukh Khan's coming back into the the limelight a little bit. Sure seems like it. After, after his hiatus. Yeah. Uh... Yeah, it sure seems like it. Yeah, because we've seen like a, like a lot He's of... He's been working a lot right now. Promotion. Yep, a lot of promotion stuff. Uh, Maybe he'll start doing interviews. We know you come here sometimes, Shah Rukh. We live in Los Angeles. We'll come to your place. No problem. I mean, it's probably better than... Probably. Maybe. A little bit better. We'll see. But... Yeah, we'll judge. If you'd like to come and see the layer, please do. <laughs> Anyways, uh, yeah, let us know uh, what should be our next Shao Khan film because uh, nobody ever asked us to do Shao Khan films. Ever. Very rare. And I know a lot of people want us to do like watch alongs, and I'd love to do a watch along at some point. Unfortunately, a lot of his films are about three and a half hours long. <laughs> and I have a toddler. <laughs> I can't leave my wife alone with a toddler <laughs> for that long, guys. So, like, maybe if it's one of his shorter ones. Or, she, also, my wife loves Shah Rukh Khan. Mm-hmm. She, like, whenever we watch a Shah Rukh Khan film, she's like, I, I love Shah Rukh Khan films. Mm-hmm. I think they're so, like, it's like we talk about. They're just enjoyable. Yeah. They're almost like rom-coms. Yeah. They're, they're enjoyable to watch. Yep. Yeah. So maybe we'd have to, like, come over after Leland goes to sleep. Yeah. And all. Because people ask us for watch-alongs all the time. All the time. But also, there's, there's, it's, if it's a three-hour film, right, I can probably only use five minutes. Absolutely. <laughs> Have fun editing that. <laughs> it does not sound fun. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, let us know what the next Shogun film should be. Get down.